back to another video. This is a weird intro, isn't it? Um, I already, I forgot to start recording, and I already started my, um, BB cream. So, in today's video, I am just, um, as requested, I am doing a glam look with a bold eye. It's kind of like this, like, fire look. I mean, it is fire. It's, like, so good, but, like... Um, it starts from a darker shade into a lighter shade, kind of like a sunset. So I'm just going in with this CoverGirl BB Cream like I use in all my makeup videos. And I'm using a little bit more than usual just because I want more coverage. Okay, so not, ev not everything is blended out yet. I'm just going to take this little flat brown brush um, to just kind of blend everything in a little bit more put on a fancy little headband. Now I'm going in with just this big round brush and I have some setting powder from Can't, um, Can't Stop Won't Stop in the shade Banana. And I'm just going to get some of that on my brush and a little bit goes a long way for the setting powder. You wanna get on your eyes too. And if, Get some on your neck too, because that's also where you put your foundation or BB cream. The obvious choice, the Hello Halo blush side of this palette thingy, whatever you call it. And just like this kind of like tip brush going in with the blush side. For the highlighter, I'm going to tap away the excess so it doesn't go everywhere. And just go right above where the blush is. Alright, just get some chapstick. That's pretty much just the face all done. I mean, you can add more if you want. Like, I don't do any bronzer stuff. But now, for mostly the eyes, I'm going to take this little double-sided comb thingy and just kind of shape my eyebrows to make it look more glamorous. Number one, the number two, number one shade. Um, it's basically my base color, so for like a base color, you want it to match your skin tone, be a little bit lighter than your skin tone, so... Ugh, let's put some lotion on, so my hands don't dry out and become brittle. Okay, so that's that's pretty much done. Um, for this, I'm going to do more of a winged look. So I'm going to use a piece of paper to kind of like create that winged look because I already have my foundation kind of base on and I don't want to ruin it with tape, so I'm just going to use some paper. With this fairy tale palette mount makeup with an attitude, um, I'm just going to go in with this little shade right here, like this pink red color. So I'm just going to take a little bit of it at first. I'm just going to line up with the edge of my brow and the edge of my eye. That and get a little bit of our color. Right, that's not as good as I thought it would be because, yeah. I just have like this random palette that has like lots of little colors in it. I don't know the brand of it. Or the company but it just has like a whole bunch of like little colors so I'm just going to be using the second kind of like palette that's in it has all of these fun colors you can tell which ones I've used the most so with the same brush kind of like getting more like not like getting more of the color off the previous color off I'm going to go in with like this like kind of like orange color down here if you can see that, let's get a little bit and kind of like right where the kind of line is, you're going to just put a little bit with this like little dark kind of yellow. I'm going to move it more on, like kind of connect it with the line. And with the same brush that I used for the for the base kind of color for this whole look like the just like the skin color I'm going in with the lightest yellow and in and I'm going to put it in like the 
in like the inner corner. Okay, I'm happy with this look. Just with like a like a little eyeliner brush. Um, this one has little stuff inside of it. I'm just going to like follow along on the lower lash line with kind of the colors that we did. I'm just going to clean up these messy edges and then finish up the look. And I'm going to give my lashes a little curl. And then using my Rocket Volume Express, my Maybelline New York mascara, I'm just going to complete the look. So here's this glam look with a bold eye. I really like how it turned out. I really love how it turned out. Um, I could have gone with some more darker yellows and stuff, but yeah, if I had if I put some eyeliner on, I think it would pull the whole look together. But honestly, it looks super cute. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, please make sure to smash the like button, comment down below what you would like to see next, subscribe if you haven't to become part of the Adventure Squad. Also, once you subscribe, make sure to turn on the bell icon next to the subscribe button to stay updated whenever I post.